we'll start with encaustic medium. This is encaustic medium. It is nine parts filtered beeswax to two parts damar. Cool. The damar acts as a hardening agent for the wax, so it's not just soft like, you know, just beeswax. And then this is our encaustic paint. So this is the encaustic medium to which the powder pigments have been professionally milled in. We don't do any single pigment mixes. They're all complex mixes. We have different sizes. So this is the next level up, 104 mil cake. And then we have the big, Huge. The big Huge. case for serious artists. Um, you can take your paint and you can melt it right on the palette to work with. All of our paints are really heavily pigmented. So you and this can, is cool, guys. You are you really don't get it yeah. over video. You this can is really cool. Add a little bit of the medium to it to extend the paint, and then you can come right on to your substrate and begin to play with it. And you can also. And I love the transition too, as it, as it cools. It's like, yeah. It goes into like the matte color, yeah. And then you can also melt it in these little palette cups, and then you get a big juicy brush stroke. Another thing that's really cool is to come in with different kinds of tools and you can carve and subtract into the wax like itself. what we would do with the gel press because exactly. a lot of us use inks and things like that you can carve in and then you can also really quickly create texture so let's create, let's use a little bit of this ultramarine blue pale and we'll do it right on top of the area where I just carve just by lightly brushing it back and forth I start to pop some of that texture and you can keep going with that for a while you could even change up the color. Let's try a little of this Jean Briant. I like to hold the brush for a few seconds so it starts to cool down. So it goes on thicker. Yeah, exactly. It's just like catching all of the texture that's underneath there. Fabulous. And then if you want, if you don't like what it looks like, you can. Come or you in. just want a little bit of a blend. Yeah, and you can yeah. start to fuse it together so that it. Bonds, or you can just melt it all back down and move it around. I think one of the that best things cool. about encaustic too is the workability. I can come back into this like a year from now and rework this paint. So you're showing me kind of what I think Erin was probably doing when she was doing hers that just felt fabulous. Melting everything together, getting all of those waves and yeah, all the blending is awesome. That is fabulous. Yeah. Thanks for stopping by and visiting our booth. Thank you, thank you, thank you.